is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the range, from Manhattan, New York, weighing 231 pounds, Chris Jericho. gentlemen, he's Taz and I'm Michael Cole here at ringside welcoming you to Minneapolis, Minnesota. Hey, I got top bill tonight. I'll pay you later. Well, what can I say? These Minneapolis fans have got me in such a great mood. I'm feeling especially generous tonight. He anticipated that move perfectly. We've seen this before. He'll do whatever it takes to win and take every advantage he can. Hey, you know, that's not gonna make you popular, but you gotta do whatever it takes to win. It's crazy to think we actually get paid to do a job like this. There's thousands of people out there who would do this for free. Really? Maybe I should look into that. I could get a better broadcast partner and save the company some money at the same time. Keep it up, Cole. Keep it up. And you're going to find out how tough this job really is when your jaw gets wide shut. partner but it's got to end sooner or later well whichever way it goes no one can say that these superstars didn't give it everything they got you know the key to winning a match like this is to build some momentum and you're not going to see a match won with just one or two moves. No, but one or two big moves at a crucial point could change the direction of it completely.
this one could still go either way, Cole. It sure could. It's not over until the referee calls for the bell. I wonder if we're going to see anything this good on Raw next Monday, Cole. Come on, Taz. I think we both know the answer to that one. I don't think he's going to win any fans over with that. It ain't about winning over the fans, though, Cole. He's letting everyone know that he don't give a damn what they think. If you ever wondered just how much punishment a human body could take, I think you're going to get an answer tonight. You might be right, Taz. It doesn't look like these superstars are going to go easy on each other. That's not what they're getting paid for, Cole. And besides, they got too much pride to give less than 100% in there. Superstars are showing some great intensity here tonight, and that's what the WWE fans came to see. That's for sure, Taz. And the number one rule here on SmackDown is to send the fans home happy. Talk about sending a message of defiance to your opponent. So, Cole, you got any predictions? Uh, you know who you think's gonna win this one? No way. I've seen you embarrass yourself with enough bad guesses that I'm not going to risk doing the same. This could be big, but it could backfire real bad, too. He's just radiating confidence. And he's got a lot to be confident about. Yeah, well, he looks a little overconfident to me, Cole. And that could come back to bite him on a you-know-what. What a counter that was. Monkey see, monkey do. You know, Cole, I'd ask you who you were pulling for in this match, but I think it's pretty obvious since the beginning who you're rooting for. I never claim to be completely objective, Taz. It's no secret I respect superstars who stick with it. Wow, great reversal. All right, time to see what kind of toys we got under the ring.
I think we might be looking at the future of the WWE in this ring tonight. Wouldn't surprise me one Man, what a chair shot. Reminds me of my old ECW days. Thank you, Captain Obvious. I just think it's unfortunate whenever a superstar decides to cheat to win rather than compete fairly. He was one step ahead on that one. Man, this match is so good, it's even worth sitting next to you to watch it, Cole. Yeah, thanks a lot, Taz. You know, you're not always my number one choice for a broadcast partner either. You know what you should do, Girl Pants? You should team up with Jerry Lawler. Then it could be the king and queen on commentary. Real funny, Taz. You know, that would almost be worth not having to work with a joker like you all the time. He dodged that bullet. A lot of people give Christian a lot of grief, but I think he's a real American hero. Well, most people have good reasons why they don't like him, Taz. And by the way, he's Canadian, not American. Oh, I see. So now we're going to give a guy grief because he's not an American. That's real nice, Cole. That's real professional on your part. Boy, Christian's a real piece of work. I don't think I've ever seen someone as in love with himself as he is. I think he's just jealous of Christian, that's what I think. I mean, Cole, look at you. You're a mess, he's not. You're a mess! What are you talking about? I'm not jealous of Christian at all. If I started acting like him, I'd hope my friends would tell me to stop being such a jerk. Okay, first of all, genius, they're peeps, not friends. And speaking of friends, you got friends? Talk about adding insult to injury. And these fans love it. Yeah, well, you know what? He better worry more about the injury and less about the insult before his match is over. Man, this, I'll tell you what, man. This one's just turned into a fight, pure and simple. We knew it was going to be intense. We knew it was going to be physical. But I don't think anyone was prepared for this. I gotta admit, it kinda took me by surprise, Cole. That don't happen too often. That's an understatement. You've been in hundreds of matches in your career. We both called hundreds more. We usually have a pretty good idea of what to expect, but not this time. I guess it just goes to show you, Cole, like they say, anything can happen here in the WWE. but this might not be the smartest course of action. This match is far from over. Can you believe this match so far, Cole? I really can't, Taz. This isn't anything like what I expected from these competitors. Yeah, I gotta admit, they're surprising the hell out of me here, too. And I think it's that unpredictability that makes these superstars so exciting to watch. These superstars have been going hard all match. They sure have. And that's where the superb conditioning of the WWE superstars comes into play. No doubt, Cole. There ain't no way you're gonna win a match if you're out of gas two minutes into it. You can say that again. 
I've seen matches won and lost simply because one superstar was able to outlast their opponent. Conditioning's a huge factor in any match. If you can't go to distance, there ain't no way you're gonna win. That's for sure, Taz. And the WWE superstars are some of the best conditioned athletes in the world. Man, I'm telling you, from my in-ring experience, trust me, you could cut this tension with a knife. I don't think you need in-ring experience to feel the tenacity radiating off these superstars, Taz. I don't think anything could be more obvious. Spoken like a guy who's never been in there, Cole. Trust me, when it comes down to you or them, it's a whole different level of intensity. I'll have to take your word for it, Taz. I honestly can't imagine a more electric atmosphere than the one in this arena right now. Gotta give him credit, Cole. He was playing possum and he got away with it. There's the pin! Can his opponent kick out? I gotta tell you, Cole, I thought I had this thing figured out, but now I got no idea how this is. Oh my, there's the submission hold. He's in the driver's seat now. No doubt, Cole, if your opponent lets you lock that in, it usually means that they ain't got much left. I think we're hearing the First Amendment in action here tonight, Taz. It's a great thing to hear, Cole. I'm all in favor of freedom of expression, whether I agree with what they're saying or not. I've been locked in this hole before, and it hurts even worse than it looks. I can't even imagine the amount of pain that this hole must inflict on any superstar who winds up in it. What an incredible match we've seen so far. And it ain't over yet, Cole. It sure isn't. I think these superstars could keep going for quite a while longer. I don't think there's gonna be anything left of these superstars by the end of this match. You're probably right, Taz. They're so focused on a victory that they don't care what they have to put themselves through to get it. You can't let your opponent continue to work over the same area of your body. Not if you want to win the match, you can't. I knew it was only a matter of time before we saw that. I don't like it, but as long as it wins matches, it's going to keep happening. That's the bottom line, Cole. If you're not doing everything you can to win, then you're in the wrong game. He slipped out of that one. I think John Cena has risen through the SmackDown ranks faster than any other superstar. He smells blood in the water, Cole. He's going straight for the submission. And this could prove to be a decisive moment in this match. 
Look at these fans. They didn't like that one bit. Yeah, well, you know what? I got some bad news for these fans. He don't give a damn what you think. His opponent has been picking him apart all match. Yeah, and I think it's just about to pay off. He's going for the submission. And he might get it. He's got that hold locked in. That reversal might stop his opponent's momentum dead. Why do they keep so many dangerous weapons under the ring? Those things can cause serious injuries. Superstars are so unpredictable. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. Don't bother, Cole. I don't think you're going to be able to. Just sit back and enjoy the ride. And what a wild ride it's been so far, with no signs of stopping anytime soon. Oh no, the referee is down. What's going to happen now? Anything and everything, Cole. No ref means no rules. He's three seconds away from a win. Way too early to get a three count. I think these fans know what's coming next. You know it, Cole. The FU. Man, get a load of that power. There's the reversal, Cole. I'll tell you, anyone who thinks this business is a piece of cake, they should get in the ring with these superstars. I don't think anyone would last too long against them. These are trained WWE professionals. Wow, you can't take too many shots from that sledgehammer and stay in this thing. This one's gonna keep on going until someone can't go anymore. And considering the conditioning of these athletes, that could be quite a while from now. He wasted no time going for that pin. And the crowd has come alive tonight with a chant directed at the superstars in the ring. Yeah, and you can't let that break your focus. But that's easier said than done. Why doesn't he put his money where his mouth is and continue with the match? Hey, slow down a little bit, Cole. He's just having a little fun in there. I think I've got a pretty good idea who's gonna win this match, Cole. I wouldn't be so... Oh, my God! What a vicious shot from that sledgehammer! A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? He likes fighting dirty. 
and it's easy to see why. He's pretty good at it. He certainly is, and I hope he's proud of himself. Personally, I find it disgusting. Great reversal! Okay, yeah, great. That's just great. Now, why don't you quit showing off and get down to business here? He is getting down to business. He's in the sports entertainment business, isn't he? I'll tell you, Cole, this is what the WWE is all about. You're absolutely right, Taz. The greatest athletes in the world competing on the grandest stage of them all. What a rare treat it is for us to see Chris Jericho competing live and in person. We don't have many chances to see this phenomenal veteran in action. What with him being a Raw superstar. Yeah, you know what? And there's the counter, Cole. I think this proves without a doubt why SmackDown's the dominant brand in sports entertainment. I can't help but agree, partner. You won't see action like this on Raw. Yeah, and even if you did, you'd have to listen to a couple of yahoos jabbering about puppies and, and government mules and uh, scolded dogs. I, t I tell you, it's like a damn zoo over there. What a reversal. He's showing absolutely no respect for his opponent. Yeah, and his opponent's not doing nothing about it. What's that tell you? I can't remember the last time I seen a crowd so pumped up. I know what you mean, partner. These superstars have really brought the fans to life here tonight. He saw that one coming. I'll tell you what, right now, it is a good thing that Chris Jericho pays his bills by wrestling and not singing. I think there are several thousand Fozzy fans out there who take issue with that, Taz. I'm glad Jericho f Oh, would you look at this? Talk about arrogant. It's sickening. Actually, I think it's great. That's not arrogance, that's confidence. And that's what wins matches. So much can go wrong from that top turnbuckle. That could be a finishing move right here. Well, I think this one's pretty much a foregone conclusion. Not too tough to figure out who's gonna win this one. You know, this wouldn't be the first time you've made a prediction that didn't pan out. What the? Th that's his opponent finishing maneuver. Oh my God, look at the blood just pouring down his face. Ha, I love it when these superstars just go in there and beat the holy high hell out of each other. 
I don't know that I'd agree with that, Taz. Two. I hate to see a superstar risk a serious injury like this. I hope this isn't the last time we see these superstars face off. You're not going to hear me say this much, Cole, but I definitely agree with you. This has all the makings of a nice, long feud. I don't know how nice it is, but there are certainly some issues between these superstars, and I think this match might only exasperate them. Jeez, Cole, watch your language, will you? It's a family show. I said exasperate. Oh, never mind. This capacity crowd is certainly getting its money's worth here tonight. And it's a good thing too, Cole. If they're not buying tickets, we're not getting paychecks. Well, I don't think we'll have to worry about selling tickets the next time we come back here. Not after a match like this. certainly don't envy the referee in this match. No kidding. No matter what call you make, you're gonna get on the bad side of at least one superstar. And that's about the last place you wanna be if you're not a superstar yourself. Trust me, I know. Fans like that one too much. <laughs> I'm sure this breaks this guy's heart. It should. These fans are the lifeblood of WWE, and he doesn't give a damn what they think. <laughs> that was a textbook reversal. It looks Here's like there just winner. wasn't enough left in the tank to kick out of the pit. Chris, that's a tough loss for sure. But if you don't have what it takes, then you don't have what it takes. I don't know if it's a matter of not having what it takes, Taz. Sometimes it's just not your night. <laughs> 